Hello, how many times did you use rotary encoders in your projects? And how many times you want to add more than one, but you find out that it's not an easy job? We present the Square C Encoder version 2, an easy way to connect multiple rotary encoders. Last year, we have created the prototype of a small board to connect encoders on e -square -C bus. After having bring up its first version, now we have created version 2 that includes more features. For example, you can mount a normal rotary encoder or an illuminated RGB encoder. To connect multiple e -square -C encoder boards, you can mount a 2.54mm connector or a GST XH connector. There are 5 castellate holes on each side. It allows the boards to be soldered together in every direction. There are also 7 SMD jumpers for setting the E2C addresses. It means that the address is fully customizable. There is no need to add external resistors on E2C bus. You can solder them directly on the board. There are also three configurable GPIOs organized with the same footprint of RGB LED. You can use these pins as PVM output, ADC input, digital input, or digital output. For example, you can mount an RGB LED or just solder some wires instead. The Square C Encoder version 2 has also 256 bytes of EE prompt. It's working between 3.3V to 5V. The board dimension is only 25 by 25 mm. In this example, you can easily connect 5 rotary encoders with 4 RGB LEDs to an Arduino board by using only 5 wires. With a few lines of code, you can read all these encoders and you get very fast response. Plus, you can drive the LED. Square C encoder is compatible with Arduino family board, Raspberry Pi, ESP8266 series boards, and many other developing boards. Thank you for watching and enjoy the campaign.